Hey guys, hope you're all doing well. I just wanted to put together a really quick and formal video that talks about the ECFMG certification changes happening in 2024 for any POOM students or for any IMGs that are curious and feel a little confused after reading the updates and the official communication online. Um, I did reach out to ECFMG to kind of verify some of this so that our students would be in the loop. We've submitted a letter for POOM students who are still confused. Make sure you're following EPSU or English Program Student Union to get all of the proper communication from our student organizations as well as official school communication like this. Um, anyways, if you have any questions or need some clarity, we're going to go through some of the basic details and hopefully this will help. So currently, in order to practice as a physician in the United States, you have to be ECFMG certified. That basically means that um, you apply for certification through ECFMG, and then you take all of the respective step exams, pass them, then you can match into residency and pursue your medical practice in the States. Currently, you can do that process online. Uh, you can just go to their website. All you have to fill out is form 186, which is the certification of identity form, and then complete the application for certification. I think there's a fee that you have to pay that's like one or 200 bucks or something. And then you're basically set up in their system. You've started your application and you can apply to take step exams through that system. That's the piece that has to be done before the change takes place. If you're trying to do this under current guidelines. So, Current guidelines basically say that your school has to be accredited by an accreditation body that the ECFMG has recognized. For POOM students, for example, we are accredited by PACA or PKA. It's our accrediting body here in Poland for medical schools. And they are recognized. They're on the current list. We're good to go. So all students up until 2024 who initiate their application through ECFMG, fill out the form I mentioned, start their application, pay the fee, they're good. We apply to current rules, that's the way that it is. Moving forward, starting in 2024, it's not as simple. Our accrediting bodies will actually have to get certified by the WFME. So that is the World Federation of Medical Education, I believe. And they're basically going through, they have a rigorous list of why a program and its curriculum can be accredited or not. And then those accreditation agencies will have to seek that before 2024. The process takes about a year. Unfortunately, it's gonna take a little bit longer than that, especially for Poland, because we're obviously geared towards American students. And so I think we're really aligned with what they're looking for already. And we've spoken to the Dean's office. They've already changed a lot of things just to make sure that these fine details are done and taken care of and that we're set. But because they accredit all of the schools in Poland, they have to make sure that every single one of them meets the same criteria that essentially we do in order to get this certification. So the process is underway. They're already working on it. It might take a little bit, but all the current students are safe and so are the next few years that start because this isn't gonna affect them essentially, right? So that kind of quells some of the anxiety that's around this. Um, I don't really know what else you guys would wanna know. I just wanted to make sure that you guys knew that this update existed. Uh, and I think a lot of people thought that their medical degrees would be invalid suddenly if this doesn't go through. It's highly unlikely that it won't. I would assume for Polish medical schools, we're longstanding and our curriculum's great. But if something does happen and you know, worst case scenario, COVID throws everyone on their head and we can't get it in time, all the current students are safe and this kind of applies to all other programs that are currently accredited under their current guidelines. So just make sure you apply for certification through ECFMG before 2024 and then study hard and pass your step exams. And then hopefully we'll all be in the States or if you want to be. Okay, hope you guys have a great day.